Welcome to Canna Spader Christmas. Man, it's been a long time. Has it been a long time? I think it's been a long time. You know, it's already November. I hope you got everything set up already. My goodness, I haven't had any time to do any videos. We've been on a land hunt for about a year now, and we've found several that we don't like. Let me give you an idea how that's going along. Pretty much all our spare time is spent looking for something that we've rejected all of them so far. Anyway, uh, more on that as, as uh, it full unfolds, I guess, so, you know, as we make progress. Once we make progress, then I'll do a report on that. How about that? So anyway, that's, that's kind of what's been going on um, in the personal life. So on the display, I did set up some stuff prior to uh, Halloween, just to kind of get uh, a few props out there, you know, that weren't Christmassy, um, uh, the matrices and outlines and things like that. Um, and, and gets the controllers out there, kind of exercises the system so that um, now that we are in November, I can set up all the Christmas stuff and, and a lot of the infrastructure will already be set up. And, and even a lot of the props that I had to get up on ladders to do. So that's good there. Um, <clears throat> as you can see from the video, uh, well, maybe you don't know. So the, that freestanding matrix has been a bit of a problem, a bit of a challenge to me, uh, as far as keeping it standing upright. Now, you know, we get this time of year seems to be every year we get wind storms that come through and, you know, they seem like they're like, I don't know, three, 400 miles an hour, you know, winds they're, they're probably realistically more like 20 miles per hour, but, but they're just, it's just blowing through here. And so every year that thing has kind of gotten torn up um, to the point that I was like, all right, this year I'm, I'm going to fix it. So I got four by fours um, and, and put a... So I got four by fours and put a slit in the middle so that the, uh, the bottom of the frame could sit in there. I figured that would be, you know, add more stability. Uh, the four by four because it's heavy and then uh, on the sides i built uh, i used two by fours to build kind of a tripod so that it, you know it would keep it from going back and forth like this and and front and back like that so i figured out you know i was golden well and so for the center i knew i needed some kind of support there so i put um the the four by four holding everything up but but just a two by four kind of holding the center bar up well, as you can see, it wasn't anchored down very well. The wind just kind of picked it up. So that, that now lost all the stability that I had and then pushed it back and, and it just kind of folded in. So uh, my solution was to get a cargo strap and jam two pieces of rebar into the ground and hook the, the uh, cargo strap over, over the top of the pole. And so far that's held. Now, I'm glad I get to test it in the next couple of days. We got some thunderstorms rolling through, so I'm looking forward to that. While I was handing out candy to the little crumb snatchers that came by, uh, I noticed that the w one of these spheres was not lighting up. And so I swapped the connections on the controller and the, the problem stayed with the prop. In other words, this one still didn't light up. So I brought it into the, you know, here, hooked it up, no lights. So then I thought, okay, well, let's, let's deal with this first pixel. So I cut the pixel out and was going to just hook the wires together to see if the rest of them worked, but I didn't have enough room. So I started, you know, looking at the, um, the pigtail that was connected to it. And I noticed this one tiny problem on one of the wires yeah so since I had it cut out already I replaced it with a new one soldered it in heat shrinked it and we're back in business <laughs> So I can put this out, uh, actually, 
I still have time tonight to see if it works. So I'm going to go run and hook that up. Um, just kind of a howdy video, getting getting back into it. Um, I do plan on having other videos um, as time permits. And I am working on the, uh, the V4, uh, the Falcon V4 videos. So uh, if you have any questions, leave them below and I will get to them. Um, other than that, Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Now I shot an email. Uh, I got six of these and so they... I got five of these. I am your father.